Okay, uh, part 15 of the truck project. Um, the IRS diff is in, um, basically I had to hard mount the, um, the diff into the chassis because the, uh, the diff suspended on um, threaded rod was uh, moving around too much to get any type of um, uh, positive uh, measurement and alignment. So basically what I've done now is uh, I've got some heavy bits of steel and I've um, pretty much welded this thing solid to the um, solid to the chassis temporarily um, and what that does now it's basically of I'll just show my little digital um, digital inclinometer um, good old eBay um, anyway that's set on zero um, happy days you know that's uh, that's flat left to right and uh, basically what I've done here for the top um, top control arms I've I've spun up a, um, a little bit of hollow rod and um, screwed one bolt out and screwed the bolt back in behind it so that gives me a, an absolute um, an absolute level on the um, the top control arm point so that's um, that bubbles in the middle so it's telling me it's uh, it's on zero and um, basically yeah I've just hard welded this to the, the chassis for now and um, what what can happen now is I can um, I can now go ahead and um, <coughs> make some nice mounts for the the chassis and uh, all that type of thing. So yeah, happy days. Um, anyway, good old laser. Um, there's my uh, my little string line and my my uh, five point uh, self centering. Uh, laser, uh, basically my original mounts. I'll just crawl into the truck here for a second. And um, yeah, what I've done, uh, still alignment stuff, but um, yeah, happy days. It all lines up. And what I've done, I've put that that prop shaft through the hubs. And uh, what that does is that um, <coughs> that simulates a, the axle line anyway so that's um that's traveling through the center of the thing there real nice so yeah, the original reference mounts have been uh, reference points marks been picked up on uh, both sides um, i put a bit of pipe through the the chassis rail at the back and marked the center off and it's um yeah, it all uh, all lines up nice. So now, I suppose the next thing is to um, gonna just uh, yeah. Next things, I'll be making mounts in the next ooh, day or two, uh, and that's it. So yeah, this thing's uh, will be pretty much in the truck permanently. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. It's taken a lot of. A lot of fussing around, a lot of measurements, a lot of this and that to get this thing um, absolutely, absolutely right. But it's um, it is uh, it is absolutely, it is absolutely spot on down to the as you can see. There's the, the laser behind the string line, and um, that laser is shooting marks across the original reference points and. <laughs> From here, um, that that laser shooting a, a mark down that plumb bob to uh, tie my original markings on the on the on the ground. Um, yeah, shooting that um, that marking is a uh, is measured off both sides, so it's absolutely joint correct. So so yeah, um, just a little progress video, but. Um, yeah, chassis mounts next. Um, cut all that temporary um, bracketing off, and um, she's in. So for now, and then I'll uh, I'll do that um, hat to convert the hold and center over, and all the rest of it. But yeah, it's the 
the most important thing here was getting it uh, in and straight and uh, level. So happy days, done that. So anyway, I'll uh, I'll leave it here for now, and uh, I might come up with uh, a chapter two, part fifteen, um, when the when the uh, chassis mounts go onto the truck frame and all that. So. Anyway, that'll do for the day. Cheers.